Welcome to Carrier Guardians Max Playlist. In this video, we are going to discuss about the problems in non-zero velocity models. So the problem is, if the string of length L is initially at rest in equilibrium position and each of its points is given the velocity. Note it down, here given is velocity. V0 sin 3 pi x by L cos pi x by L where 0 less than x less than L at time t equal to 0. Determine the displacement function y of x comma t. So in the sum they given velocity at a length 0 to L at a position time t equal to 0. We have to find a displacement for this function. Nothing but y is nothing but y of x of t. Here they given y of x of t. So this is under non-zero velocity model. In this non-zero velocity model, uh, we are going to see one problem, okay? So usually we are writing the wave equation, already know that dou square y divided by dou t square equal to a square into dou square y divided by dou x square. The conditions, after that we have to write the conditions. The conditions are y equal to zero when x equal to zero. y equal to zero when x equal to l. First two conditions represent boundary condition. And third one here I return y equal to 0 because here given is non-zero velocity. So that fourth condition should be velocity condition. So third condition we have to write y equal to 0 when t equal to 0. Fourth condition I am writing here dou y by dou t equal to f of x. Usually when uh, giving working rule I given here f of x. But uh, here we should mention what is that f of x because in this sum they given velocity. So dou y by dou t is equal to f of x. That f of x is v dot sin 3 pi x by l cos pi x by l when t equal to 0. So is this our uh, suitable solution y equal to a cos px plus b sin px into c cos pat plus d sin pat. This is our equation 1. So after that in step 1 we have to apply condition 1 in equation 1. I will get equation 2. In step 2 we have to apply condition 2 in equation 2. I will get equation 3. In step 3 directly we can substitute uh, condition 3 in equation 3. I will get uh, the most general solution is y equal to sum of n is equal to 1 to infinity c at sin n pi x by l sin n pi a t by l which is our equation 4. Here we taken c n already I told why we taken here c n okay in while given in the um, working rule for non-zero velocity and step 4 we have to apply condition 4. Here we cannot be able to apply directly condition 4. This equation 4 we have to partially differentiate then we can apply the condition 4. So now we can apply that condition 4 v0 sin 3 pi x by l cos n pi x by l equal to summation n is equal to 1 to infinity bn sin n pi x by l. When substituting t equal to 0 entire term 0. Here we substituted bn. How we substituted bn? When substituting condition 4, you will get Bn equal to Cn uh, n pi a by l. So, we consider this is Bn. After finding Bn, we have to equating to Cn. Cn equal to l divided by n pi a into Bn. Okay. Next, we substituted uh, both the term, uh, both the side V0 sin 3 pi x by l cos pi x by l is equal to, you will have summation n is equal to 1 to infinity bn sin n pi x by l. So here left hand side you will have the term uh, sin and cos. Consider sin a cos b. So I am applying sin a cos b equal to 1 by 2 sin of a plus b plus sin of a minus b. Consider here a equal to 3 pi x by l, here b equal to pi x by l. So sin 3 pi x by l into cos pi x by l is equal to 1 by 2 of sin of a plus b plus sin of a minus b. You will get sin 4 pi x by l plus sin 2 pi x by l. Left hand side I am writing v0 and 1 by 2 into sin 4 pi x by l plus sin 2 pi x by l. Right hand side you will have the term sum of n is equal to 1 to infinity bn sin n pi x by l. So left hand side I will expand this term v0 by 2 into sin 4 pi x by l plus v0 by 2 into sin 2 pi x by l. Right hand side we expand that series. Why? Whenever you will get the form 
whenever we get the function in the term of sin or cos now we no need to find bn directly we can equating both the side so that here right hand side I expand this series n equal to 1 to infinite number of terms we can apply so first I applied b1 n uh, n equal to 1 I will get b1 sin pi x by l next I applied b2 I will get sin 2 pi x by l next I applied 3 b3 sin 3 pi x by l next I applied n is equal to 4 I will get b4 sin 4 pi x by l similarly we can apply infinite number of terms here left hand side you will have the term sin 4 pi x by l sin 2 pi x by l that means equating the coefficient of both the side sin 2 pi x by l and sin 4 pi x by l so right hand side you will have sin 2 pi x by l term sin 4 pi x by l term remaining all the terms are 0 because there is no coefficient for remaining all the terms so sin 2 pi x by l is equal to both the side here b2 here v0 by 2 so I am writing b2 equal to v0 by 2 and next one I am equating the coefficient of sin 4 pi x by l sin 4 pi x by l is equal to coefficient b4 right hand side here you will have b4 and this side you will have v0 by 2 both sin 2 pi x by l sin 4 pi x by l coefficient is v0 by 2 only so v0 by 2 you will get so already I given one formula for finding cn here we know b2 b4 equal to some values remaining b1 and b3 and b5 rest of all equal to 0 okay then already you know one formula for finding cn cn equal to l divided by n pi a into bn okay this is our uh, general term here i'm getting the answer only for uh, 2 and 4 so here i'm substituting n equal to 2 i'll get c2 equal to l divided by 2 pi a b n b2 so what is your b2 value b2 is what for b2 is v0 by 2 just i am going to substitute here b2 equal to v0 by 2 so l divided by 2 pi a into b2 is equal to v0 divided by 2 so i will get c2 equal to L V naught divided by 2 into 2 4 4 pi a this is our C2 similarly here I am going to substitute uh, n is equal to 4 C4 is equal to L divided by 4 pi a B4 ok here we know B4 also V naught by 2 so c4 is equal to l v0 divided by 4 into 2 8 8 pi a so this is our answer instead of b2 b4 we converted into c2 c4 why because of your most general solution i taken in the form of cn so we have to convert that bn value into cn so we converted end of the problem now i am going to substitute this c2 and c4 in our equation 4 but we cannot uh, apply directly here uh, c2 c4 because here uh, they given general term we have to expand this series how to expand this series again you can substitute n equal to 1 to infinite number of terms i can expand that series so y equal to um, first I am going to apply 1 c1 sin pi x by l into sin pi a t by l when substituting 1 next I am going to substitute 2 c2 sin 2 pi x by l and sin 2 pi a t by l plus next i am going to substitute 3 
सी थ्री सैन थ्री पै एक्स बै एल अंड सैन थ्री पै एटी बै एल नेक्स्ट ऐम गोइंग टू सब्स्यूट फॉर एन ईक्वल टू फोर एल गेट सी फोर सैन फोर पै एक्स बै एल इंट सैन फोर फै एटी बै एल सिमिलरली वी कैन अ infinite number of terms in this uh, equation i am going to substitute c2 and c4 rest of all the values are zero c1 c3 and up to infinite number of terms are zero i am going to substitute only c2 and c4 so y is equal to y is equal to the c2 value is l into v not divided by 4 into 5a into sin 2 pi x by l into sin 2 pi a t by l plus c4 is l into v not divided by 8 into 5a sin 4 pi x by l into sin 4 pi a t by l so end of this problem we will get the answer in the term of c2 and c4 remaining all the values are zero so we expand the series we will get the answer only for c2 c4 we substituted that c2 c4 in our general solution we will get this answer now again i am recalling what we seen in this video we taken one problem for a non zero velocity here the velocity is given in the term of sin so we can find easily our final answer because whenever they given uh, the function velocity or whatever may be in the term of sin or cos now no need to find bn just we can equating both the side we will get the answer easily so usually we are writing the wave equation first and uh, conditions what we given in the problem based on that we written condition and uh, we written suitable solution so after that uh, we have to apply the conditions in our equations one by one step 1 step 2 step 3 step 4 while applying step 3 we will get the most general solution this we taken here c n form after applying condition 4 we will get here uh, bn how we get bn so bn is cn into n by a by l we will get so i written that uh, cn into n by a by l equal to bn so we get this term then after that both side uh, already i told uh, both side we can equating the coefficients so according to that this sin 3 pi x by l into cos pi x by l and going to apply the formula sin a cos b formula i expanded uh, based on that we will get the answer 1 by 2 into sin 4 pi x by l plus sin 2 pi x by l i substituted uh, this value in our uh, term i will get v not divided by 2 into sin 4 pi x by l and plus v not divided by 2 into sin 2 pi x by l and right hand side i expand this bn into sin n pi x by l so i substituted n equal to 1 2 3 4 5 like that infinite number of terms after that uh, i equated the coefficients of both the sides you will have sin 2 pi x by l and sin 4 pi x by l rest of the values are zero so that means when equating the coefficient of both the term we will get b2 equal to v not divided by 2 and b4 equal to v not divided by 2 remaining all the values are b1 b3 b5 are zero here we identify the values for uh, bn i mean uh, b1 b2 b3 b4 b5 like that but in our uh, general solution in the form of cn so how to convert bn into cn that is a formula cn equal to l divided by n pi a bn okay so from that cn equal to l divided by n pi a into bn in this equation i am going to substitute n equal to i will get c2 b2 value here we substituted i will get c2 in final answer And similarly n equal to 4 i substituted i will get c4 equal to this but here now we know c2 and c4 
but our equation 4 will be in the form of cn we have to expand this uh, series we have to substitute n equal to 1 2 3 4 like that you will get c1 sin pi x by l into sin pi a t by l when substituting 1 next substitute 2 c2 sin 2 pi x by l into sin 2 pi a t by l in similarly we can substitute 3 and 4 we will get this uh, term c1 c2 c3 c4 here now I am going to substitute C2, C4. Rest of all the constant values are 0. Already you know that why it is 0. So C2, C4 I substituted. I will get this answer. This is our uh, final answer. Thank you. So in this non-zero velocity model, I solved the sign term problems. So in your book, they will give in the variable model also. Variable model also similar procedure. But we have to find uh, initially Bn. Then uh, after finding Bn, you can equating to Cn, you will get a Cn value. That Cn value you can substitute in your uh, equation 4, you will get final answer. Why we need to find here Bn? Because of Fourier half range sign series model, so we can able to find Bn. That is uh, another model in this non-zero velocity. The year, we I given only the basic problems. Uh, remaining you have to practice more on this. You will get it easily 16 mark from this unit. Uh, I teach in this unit only for uh, one dimensional wave equation. This is enough for you. Definitely you will get one 16 mark from this section. Thank you.